you guys are bored and you need some new games, then I highly recommend G2A.com. The link is in the description below. Hey, how's it going guys? It's CK here and welcome back to American Truck Simulator. I loved this game in the first episode. Great for cruising and chilling. So as you can see, we are joined yet again by this lovely little truck right here. We're actually continuing a job which I done last night. We're just starting it off. So yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into the Actione then. Let me make sure we don't run that guard down which is right there. So yeah, I read your comments and everything guys. I'm aware that I'm not the best driver in this. So yeah, give me some time. I should be able to improve. But yeah, I'm, I'm not really caring if I drive that great in this game. Seriously, I know that has the whole point of it, right? But, yeah, um, I'm more of a do-whatever-the-hell-I-want sort of driver. <laughs> I know that's a bad, bad, bad thing to have in real life, but, uh, yeah, this is the game. <laughs> Just wait for this guy to go by, and indicators, we shall turn them on. Now, as usual, we've got a lot of things to talk about. As you all know, this series is going to be used for chatting and everything, my favourite thing in the world. The first thing is that the guys over at WRC actually sent me a code out for WRC5. Now, big thanks to them. I'm not too sure if the video's already went up. If it hasn't, it'll be up after this one. Uh, but yeah, big thanks to them. They're actually going to be sending me a pair of headphones out as well. And yeah, I just got the shock of my life when I seen their message on Twitter. So yeah, expect to see a video of that. If it's not already been done. Why was I going to turn there? I don't know why. Look at the bloody sat nav, man. Look at the bloody sat nav. I'm getting too distracted. Uh, but yeah, I never normally get them sorts of opportunities, guys, so when things like that does roll around, I just take them. I really do. Especially if they're for free like that. And yeah, I've played it already. It seems to be a really, really good game, and I like it. A lot of fun. The only other things I can remember getting is a copy of Forza Motorsport 6 from Turn 10, which was greatly appreciated, and actually getting invited down to Playground Games when Horizon 2 was first coming out. That was insane. Really hope they do that again for Horizon 3. God, it's a tight, twisty turnaround here today. Okay, man, I really need to get used to these indicators, seriously. There we go, because I keep on flicking the opposite one on when the right one and stuff like that. You know what I mean. You know what I mean, man. Two more cars coming. What is that? Is that a prize lawyer, isn't it? Right, we can go now. Go, 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 go! Let's do this thing, man. Catch up with the Tesla. <laughs> I loved some of your comments uh, when I reacted to that Tesla. Pretty funny. So, thanks for all the support in this series, guys. Even though it's only been, like, the first episode in this episode, you guys are loving it. Thank you. Now, a lot of you said that the speed limits kind of vary in the States. Some parts is, like, 70 miles an hour for the motorway or the interstate. And there's some, like, 65 and 50. So, I don't really know. I'm just going to stick to around about 60. Around about that. Play it safe. One thing we do need to do though is actually get some fuel because we're kind of halfway there. Uh, so whenever I see a fuel station we might bump in. Um, I don't know if we can make it to the place that we're actually going to be going to. We should be able to, not too sure but yeah, tomorrow or today when you're actually watching this, um, I'm going to be up in the office trying to sort out my new like office chair. It's going to be like a racing style one, I mentioned it before in the previous video, we need to break big time to get down here. Should have indicated. There we go, that's it. Um, but yeah, it's a nice cool design, black and blue. Um, the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm gonna need to be I'm gonna need to be up there from 12 o'clock in the afternoon to 5 o'clock at night because the freaking electrician's coming out to put in the new electricity box. So yeah, I've got the Wi-Fi sorted as I said in the last video. Cannot wait for this. And yeah, the racing seat's gonna be a lot more comfy than one I'm in right now. A lot more padded. It's gonna be a lot more comfy, it's gonna be a lot more squishy, bruh. It's gonna be like a Jaffa cake for your ass. <laughs> gonna be like a. I bet, <laughs> I bet you no one's ever said that before. It's like a Jaffa cake for your ass. Stopped and discovered. Piggies. Dun dun dun. I'm not going that fast, so you can't pull me over. I just get done watching the new Mirror's Edge Catalyst trailer, guys. It looks fantastic, man. I don't know if you've played the old Mirror's Edge. I played it a little bit. That was when I was really, really young. I didn't really understand the game, but if I was to go back to it now, yeah, I would really, really like it. Kind of like free running and everything, jumping over buildings. It's a pretty awesome concept, but this one looks like it's got more of a story with it. It's got a lot more action. It's a lot more, like, properly developed and stuff, because the glitch videos on the third-person view in the original game is hysterical. I think it was Mesh Yourself that made one. Pretty funny. Posted Express. Stop advertising the game. 
<laughs> I don't know if these are actually real companies. I highly doubt it. That would cost them a lot to get licensed. There's that GCB thing again. Look at that. That is awesome. I love them things. I mean, I'm not really a big fan of like heavy, heavy machinery and that, but trucks and stuff, like the classic Optimus Prime style trucks, I love that. I really want one of these to be in the game. And someone's just come in my house because there's been a big rattle of the door. Sorry about that, guys. My house is made like a freaking cardboard box. Seriously, but if you just tap a wall, you can hear it. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to Mirror's Edge Catalyst. I might make a few videos on it as well. But this leads me on to a better question for you guys. I am tailgating this guy like a motherfucker right now. I need a break. Um, but yeah, what is your most hyped game for this year, 2016? Me, obviously it has to be Forza Horizon 3. Because I'm a Forza guy. I really do like that. Uh, but also... God, there's so many things coming out. Uh, I know I'm not a big fan of on. Oh, what the fuck's it called again? Uncharted, that's it. It's gonna be called Unraveled. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, yeah, I'm not a big fan of that, but I have seen a few people play the older ones, and it's a right laugh. It does look pretty fun, but yeah, I think it's one of them situations where I'd rather watch the person play it rather than play it myself. It's kind of like many other games in that case. Bloodborne, for example, I know I've done a couple of videos on it, but. I watched the Game Grumps play that, it's hysterical, Life is Strange as well, I watch, um, I think it was Jacksepticeye that I watched, a Let's Play on, but yeah, that was a really, really cool game, but The Walking Dead, I can't wait for that to return, that's a really, really good series. So apart from Horizon 3, I generally do not know. A set of Corsos coming out on consoles in May, I think, April or May, so that'll be pretty interesting to see what the physics going to be like on that, plus they're adding the Ferrari 488 GTB in. Oh, happy days, happy days, man. I love that. That's only if you pre-order it, I think, you get that car, but... Tch, I've got my pre-order down anyway. I'm going to be getting it. It's going to look good, man. So, I think we're heading into Fresno. I don't know if we are or not, but... Yeah, I am still loving this game, guys. Just right now, my, my mind's everywhere else. And you don't really need a lot of concentration. It's only when you get to the corners and everything. So yeah, it's a lovely, lovely game, this, and it's turning to night. Ooh! Can we actually turn the lights on? Yes, we can! There we go! First time we're doing that properly in the game. God, I can't wait till we get to, like, more proper out-of-nowhere places, like in the desert and stuff. Places like the crew and everything. Wait a minute, Fresno? That is the place I'm thinking of that was in the crew with the little motel, isn't it? There's mountains next to it. I'm pretty sure it is. I wonder if we can overtake this guy. I'm going to do it. Because he's been driving very, very slowly indeed. Really, really want to overtake him. Can I afraid? Because it's very, very narrow. Come on. There we go, man. You've been too slow. Make way for the more dominant truck. I need to get to my destination. I really do, man. I don't know why in these two episodes I've always put... The Jamaican accent's on. I really need to stop for fuel there, though. Oh, we're gonna chance it. Come on, big beauty. You can do it. I think that's what I'm gonna call her. Or the truck. <laughs> Not her, the truck. I think that's what I'm gonna call it. Big beauty. I mean, that is a proper truck name, isn't it? Big beauty. Black Betty and stuff. Well, Black Betty's more of a muscle car name. So another thing that was just revealed was the Fast and Furious 9 and 10 release schedules, or release dates. Oh, Crop Duster Plane! Oh, that was awesome! That's awesome! This really reminds me of Forza Horizon 1 right now. Uh, but yeah, as I was saying, not getting sidetracked again. Uh, release dates for Fast and Furious 9 and 10 actually got released, and I believe it's in April for all of them? April 2019 for Fast 9, and I think it's April 2021 for Fast 10. So I think they should stop it at Fast 10. That'd be great. They're talking about spin-off films as well, but I'm not too sure, man. Not too sure. What do you guys make it? Let's see. This guy with the JCB can move his behind. That'd be great. He sort of works just there, isn't it? It's over this bridge. Should be over there. There you go. Thank you very much, mate. Appreciate it. I appreciate you. You loyal. There we go. I can't see what's coming on that side because I'm at a slight angle, but fuck it, let's go. Indicators. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it's my pet peeve. I never use them. Bloody hell. 
There we go. It's a nice looking Hudson Hornet right there. Pretty sure it is a Hudson Hornet, but it is good. It looks very, very good. So let's jump into Walbert. Drop this big bitch off, and we should be good to go, I think. Let's see, there we go. Bakersfield discovered. That's that. Press enter. Where do you need it? Let's play it safe. Or sorry, I'm in a hurry. I think I'm just going to do let's play it safe today, guys. I'm not in the mood to like properly go freaking mental with the steering. So yeah, we've seen that in the first part of the video, or the first part of the let's play. It was pretty mad. Pretty pretty mad. Uh, so we need to go around this way, don't we? Oh God. Oh Jesus. Right, okay. It's going to be a bit of a challenge, but I'm up for it. I'm up for it. Actually, tell you what, it won't be. If we just drive in like this, it should be fine. We need to watch ourselves though. We might hit the truck off of that. Okay, keep her going, keep her going. That's it. Okay, oh, 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 shit. Is that it? Please tell me we got it. Cargo's ready. How How off of... Off of a... Uh, oh my god, that is... <laughs> I mean, this is relatively okay. Let's go forward a little bit. Oh, for God's sake, let me just do it. Let me do it, man. Let me do it, bruh. There we go. Hit T or just joy hat switch up, whatever it is. Bada bing, bada boom. That's it. Excellent again? How? <laughs> I'm doubting myself too much on this, seriously. I cannot believe how long I've actually been recording for. That is insane. Time goes by so quickly when you play this game, man. It's unreal, but... Anyway, we're going to end it off here for this job today, guys, in American Truck Simulator. Let me know if you want to see some more. I probably will be making more anyway, because I love this game to bits. I hope you've enjoyed it, guys, and if you have, then a like would be much appreciated. It just helps us out big time. It truly, truly does, and you'd be awesome if you'd done that. And subscribe to the channel if you do want to see some more of this and other racing games out there. Thanks for watching, but for me and Big Beauty, we'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.